morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, little Timmy. Good morning, Big Del. What's up, Nick? Nick. Hey, what's up, Nick? What's up, Timmy? What's going on? Hey, what's up, Del? How y'all doing this morning? Amazing. How Amazing. How, Amazing. How about you? Amazing. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, yeah, I'm he saw the best in me. <laughs> you know, black people just break out the gospel song. Who who I'm getting the echo from? That, that was me. Is that me? Okay. That was that was me. I got it. All right. How y'all doing this morning? Man, we great. You uh, where you at, Timmy? I'm in the hood. Secret location. Huh? I'm in a secret location in the hood. Secret location. <laughs> What's the secret, clown? <laughs> the secret is. Man, I, I I should tell you where I'm at just because I got to get shot. I'm at Belmont and Poppins Grove just because I get shot. Don't know why you're here because y'all know little Timmy is a punk ass police and you ain't know. coming. I ain't got nothing. Good morning, Bree. Welcome to the party, boo. What's up, Bree? Good morning. Oh. What's up, Bree? Bree. Bree, Bree. What's up, sister? I'm trying to get my shit situated. Happy Friday. We made it. We made it. We made it through the week. It's, it's week. Friday. It's Friday. It's the weekend. Oh, yeah. Let me go ahead and tell you Happy Father's Day, Timmy. Man, it's our weekend. Oh, huh? Even Father's though it don't Day, really brother. mean that. Don't mean. It don't really mean. You know, fathers, don't, fa fathers don't really get too much love till you get like 80. Even then, it don't count because you don't even know you're getting it. You be like, life's going to go. <laughs> oh, I wonder why that is. What do you think that is? What? Well, that feels like shit. Why we get treated like shit? Yeah, I don't know. I think, I think it's just so so much ne negative uh, connotation behind being a father. A lot, especially in the black community, that fathers don't be there. You know, that's the big stigma. You know what I'm saying? But I think the ones that's there usually get love on Father's Day. Bullshit. Let, let's have a Father's Day cookout, and who cooking on the grill? The father. <laughs> Every time. Man, welcome to the party, little Zoombug. Welcome, welcome. Who else? You see our father? Hey, Dale, you saw the Father's Day commercials? Lawnmowers, tractors, all that shit. <laughs> Riches and boxes. Y'all get diamonds and dinners and all stars and shit. <laughs> we put up more. We put up more. We do more for you niggas, man. Oh, right, that's bull crap. It takes two to raise a family. Well, I'm sorry, I don't hear that bullshit. Okay. They treat like dirt. They treat they treat fathers like dirt. They do. Hey, I saw, I saw, I saw the, I saw the funniest, the funniest meme talking about <laughs> telling, telling studs don't be looking for no fathers they gifts. Did this clown just say studs though? <laughs> that's what the, that's what the meme said. That's what the meme said. <laughs> I don't do. They do be looking for fathers they get. Thank you, Bree. Fathers are important. We love you, Bree. We love yeah, you, Bree. You. And if you're if you're a single mother, you still don't get a father they give. You're not a father. Because right, right. A father too. I'm the father and the mother. You just know you're not. You're a single ass mother. Made, you're a single mother who made a bad choice with your vagina. It's your fault. <laughs> you knew he wasn't shit when you laid down with him. <laughs> Good morning, Gerald. What's up, Gerald? Thank y'all for joining us. Uh, like and share this feed. Welcome. What up, what up, Miss Carmichael? I see you, Miss Carmichael. Who is Miss Carmichael? Good morning, Miss Carmichael. I like that name. I just like I the Mrs. Carmichael. Like Miss mm -hmm. Gillicotti or something. Miss <laughs> McGillicotti. I remember that name. All right, <clears throat> we got a few things. <clears throat> that coffee went down the wrong way. Mm. Ain't a, it ain't your first time. It was <laughs> it's the first time you swallowed some of that. It's Friday with friends. We in here. Um, hopefully, before the end of this broadcast, we can select one of our friends. One of our friends right. can talk to us. And close us out or something, just something. We want to fuck with y'all because y'all fuck with us. And every weekday morning, we right here talking about anything and everything and absolutely nothing. Absolutely, absolutely nothing. nothing. Let's get off. Let's get off. <laughs> okay. You know, y'all seen them gender swapping Snapchat filters, right? 
Yeah. Whoa, that, that's that's crazy, right? Those are crazy. That is so yeah. creepy. I don't think I'm the only one, but that is like the creepiest shit you ever did want to see, man. I don't really like them. Have you done it? Any one of y'all done it? And this is a woman. No, I've never done it. I don't, I, don't really use, I don't really use the filters because I'd be like, most of the filters are for women anyway. I was like, I don't want to look like no gay yeah. bunny. If you're, if, you're, if, you're, if, you're, if, you're, if you're a nigga with a fucking, uh, if you're a man and you on Facebook or on Instagram, you sitting there with the bunny ass. Well, you sitting there with a fucking balloon on top of your head. Kill yourself. Kill your fucking self. <laughs> if you, you're right, if you're right, a man, right. You, you like, sitting there with filtering yourself. Kill yourself. <laughs> and and Dell don't do it because he don't really know how. We didn't want to say that, but he don't really know how. Welcome to the party. Lisa. No, I'm like, tell me though, why why I want sparkly um stars flying around my fucking head for? Oh. I don't, every oh, every Snapchat that. filter on there is for women. I'm like, I don't want to be no. No gay unicorn. What the fuck? I want to be a unicorn for. <laughs> I'm I'm six six three hundred pounds. What the fuck? I look like being a unicorn. <laughs> that is the creepiest thing, though. So this apparently um, did some gender swapping filters, Snapchat filters, and uh, he he actually wait a minute. The Snapchat filter catches a cop, a cop speaking underage girls online. Okay, I don't know. I mean, it's just like this is just so disgusting for no reason. Why, yeah. do? These are the ones we were talking about yesterday that needs that law for castration. Exactly, I agree. Well, yeah, but these ain't going to be the ones that we get. And that's what I'm afraid of. And I said this to you, and I'll say it again. These ain't going to be the ones that we get. The ones that we get are going to be other children, probably falsely accused. Some of these crimes be so heinous, man. I'd be like, let's just kill them in front of everybody and make people think twice about it. I'm with you, Dale. That's them. Why are you acting like you can't hear us? You acting like an old man. I know. I'm sorry. Let me. Uh, let me. Let me do. It. I was trying to do something. I got. I got some stuff going on. I'm trying to hang in there with y'all. With y'all. But I had to turn my. I turned my volume down too low. We want you to turn the goddamn TV off. How about that? <laughs> Be present. Be present. Sir. I'm. I'm here. He got the news playing like somebody's grandma and shit. I know. Be quiet. <laughs> Be quiet. Shut up. The, the weather's up. Shut up the weather. <laughs> That's my grandma. Hey, I don't quiet. give a damn. Be quiet. I'm trying to see what it, I'm trying. No, no. You know, you know how black grandma was in the south. Be quiet. I'm trying to see what the number was. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Roshan, welcome to the party from Miami. What's going on, y'all? Hey, hey, Miss Jenkins, good morning, good morning. All those people that's checking in on my feed that want to comment, go to Nikki Moore on Facebook and join the party there. That way you can comment and join in on yeah. the chat. Yeah, I'm going to share it right now to uh, you and Timmy, and y'all just follow along. How's everybody doing this morning? That's what I want to know. Do we check in? So anybody, we want to hear your comments if you think these Snapchat filters are creepy as fuck. Because they are creepy. They are. They creepy as hell, man. I think. I mean, I think. I think it's cute for for women and, and girls, but dudes can't really Snapchat no filter. Now some of these face changing filters they got, like I seen this girl yeah. do a filter, and she looked like she want it showed her how she would look as a man. I was like, that's that's too much. That's too much. And they, look so, they, they look so real. You know what I mean? Like, this is the kind of stuff that, that people use, like the government use, like that facial recognition software and stuff like that. Right, right, yeah. yeah. They crazy. That shit will fool you. You fuck around and think you got Keisha and you fuck around with Keisha. <laughs> you got Keisha, you're you on Keisha magazine too. You meet him. Ah, what's up? I'm Keisha. Nigga, what? You was Keisha? Hey Tim, throw back from yesterday. Hey boo. <laughs> <laughs> you ready? 
Ben Dover. Like, wait, what? I bet, I bet my dick bigger than y'all. <laughs> All right. Yo, don't forget to like and share this feed, man. Like, everybody that's watching us right now, we love y'all to death, but we really just need y'all to hit that share button one time. Hit the share We're button this, one time. We are this close from a TV show. Like this, this fucking close. Anyway, how close? This, this close, like that close, like that close on the TV show. We're in talks right now. We're we're, we're in talks with Channel Twenty Thousand. Right. <laughs> Nobody in my neighborhood don't have that many zeros on their television. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> y'all make a Let's listen. Huh? Yeah. Let's listen okay. to this bullshit. Yeah. Real life, real life crime fighting. Yeah. What they getting, Timmy? A twenty? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what they? He said. When they, when they get that dub, they get that dub too. <laughs> what yeah. you give my chain? Yeah. What's up? So my girl, yeah. one of my favorite y'all, Robin Givens is coming back to television. I love her. She I don't know why I'm clapping. And she's still gorgeous. Look at her. Oh, I can't oh. wait. I am beside myself pretty excited. So oh, yeah. apparently Robin did confirm filming. Little Timmy is frozen, but that's okay because he's tripping anyway. He, no, he there. He's okay. just in the bad area. <laughs> he's probably fucking with me. Okay. <laughs> anyway. Robin Givens has confirmed filming with the Real Housewives of ATL, uh, uh, Kenya Moore. Her and Kenya met on the set of uh, Bounce TV's Saints and Sinners. And, okay. you know, they were longtime friends, but they really became extra close recently while, while working on Saints and Sinners. And so Robin is coming to TV. Yesterday we talked about Miss Nene. Having yeah, so, I wonder. I wonder if she leaving. Is Nene leaving, and this is going to be the replacement for her? Robin Gibbons going to be the replacement, which I think. I think she might be a combination of both. Right? She might be a combination of Nene and Kenya Moore, but with a little shade and a little and a little um dinginess. A little more polished Kenya Moore. Because Miss right. Robin been giving shade since, like, you know, shade was just oh. She was shade motherfuckers before they knew they was shade. She been shade. She got a lot of drama when she done dated um, Mike, she married Mike Tyson. She done dated Howard Stern. She was on the news the other day. They was talking about how um, they asked her a question about how was Howard Stern's sex and was his penis a decent size and all that. And she just gave a, a politically correct answer just say he was good at everything. So the women kind of went with a thing like, oh, that nigga, he pussy good. <laughs> he probably didn't do none of that. What he did was he spent money good. That's probably what he did. Oh, yeah, yeah. Plenty, plenty of money. Howard making plenty of money. He sure got plenty of money. I'm telling you, I am so here for it because I, I love Mr. Ronald Gibbs, honey. And, um, and she, she's a, an amazing actress. She's an actress, you know, and I don't know where she's been, though. I wonder what she's been doing. I'm curious to know what she's been doing all these years. She, uh, so, y'all say, just make sure we all make it. Y'all remember the ones that's always watching. We're not going to only remember. Oh, hey, we, hey, we, hey, we're not going to remember you, Coffee. We're going to fly you all the way out to the home studios in Waldorf, Maryland. We're going to fly you in the Waldorf, Maryland to the home studio and let you sit in. From Brandywine. <laughs> From Brandywine. <laughs> we're going to fly you to the <laughs> Yo, okay. We not going in with no bullshit. We going all the way there. We gonna have a driver pick you up in our um custom wrap Geo Storm and bring you down and bring you to the to the studio. Uh, you gonna have your own behind the, behind the Chick Fil A and water off. <laughs> money slipping this shit out in these streets. We're going to make sure the minute you walk through the door, baby, your bunny slippers going on your feet. We do. Oh, my God. So, shout out for the final time to Robin Giddens, and I can't wait to see her on The Real Housewives of ATL. And, yes, I watch this every, every episode. So, hope Timmy, hope Timmy, all right, look like Timmy started driving, like he might have had a call or something he had to take care of. So, I hope you all right. 
Look like he had to start moving. Look like he needed to go take care of something. You think the car works? You think the fucking car works? No, that it look. It look like he was talking too much. Yeah, you know folks got guys to push him around the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, y
what people like, what they buy into. So uh, Roshan says, stop playing coffee, <laughs> Cardi. Hold on. Stop playing with Cardi. Oh, no, we love Cardi. I love her to death, man. I love her to death. Yeah. I mean, I listen to all her music and everything, but I, I can appreciate her her um her story and her come up because she because she kept it she kept it one hundred the whole way, and she still keep it one hundred. I love her. Do you know any of her music? Oh yeah, I, I I hear people singing it and all that, but I'm not I'm not really like I'm not a Nicki Minaj fan or I mean, but if it's something that I like, I like it. You know what I'm saying? But I don't know like I can't sit here and tell you nothing verbatim. You know what I'm saying? But I know if I hear some of my song and, and it's catchy, it's cool. You know what I'm saying? But the people like it. That's all that matters. I just like her as a person. Let me tell you something, sir. I take the difference. You just said something verbatim. Okay. That's what I'm saying. I know that that's 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 a catchphrase that's going out right now. I don't see it on TV. I don't see it on the she got she had a what was that? A Pepsi commercial? Yeah. Yeah, she had a Pepsi commercial, got it. The oh got her a Pepsi commercial. You know, hey, hey shout out to her. That girl got a millions. You know what I'm saying? Hey. Oh, girl, you sound just like a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know. I'm just, hey, I'm just, I'm just blessed that I can roll my tongue. Hey, you know. I was born, I was born, I was born in um, New Mexico, so I, I can roll my arms. <laughs> Oh God. I can't. <laughs> I can't. I can't. I was talking to the back, I don't think he is because he's out with that new opinion. We just hope he will. He will hopefully check in before we get up out of here. Perhaps. But, um, Nevertheless, as always, I just want to give a little plug. Boycott Linda Fairstein. She's a horrible, wicked witch. Speaking of a Cruella DeVille who uh, frames the Central Park Five, okay? So, I want us to all know. Yeah, Pam, he is good. Do it again, Dale, one more time. Was she talking about me or Timmy? She talking about your ass. <laughs> oh, grrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
these had to be some just some young kids joyriding trying to get a car to joyride and these were no professional thieves that had their weapons with them because she might have would have got shot wow it's a possibility you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. if they wanted their car yeah if they needed their car if they need their car for a real breakdown that, that could have turned out worse but Hey man, I man, my hat's off to it though. But first of all, a woman, if you if you from the eight, if you from the eight, you know you shouldn't be on college park at that Tesco at that time of night by yourself pumping gas. Yeah. Hold on. I'm trying to turn this talking while I'm trying to pull the video up. So we're gonna watch the video. It's a commercial playing right now. I'm gonna let the sound with no sound. But if you if you out there, you watching us, man, and y'all seeing this video, her jumping in this car. I'm going to start a petition for this to be a new Summer Olympic sport. Because right. <laughs> yeah. she jumped in that motherfucking car better than um, um, the, the dude from Dukes of Hazzard. She, she, hey, right. hey, she was not playing. Let's just say, if you think you're still in her shit, you better think again, okay? Because it's not going down. It's not going down. Yeah, hey, Dad, you see it? I'm getting static feedback from your end. Whatever you got your microphone, try to turn the panel away from the uh, mic. Let me turn it down again. Let me, let me turn it down. Is that, is that better? Yes, thank you. Okay, so let's watch the video. Let's watch this lady. I don't know her name, but she's my new hero. I'll tell you that. Uh, I need her every time I go get gas because she is that. That's right, B. College Park, that is the South Side. College Park, that's the South Side. I went to school on the South Side, so that, that is the South Side, definitely. Let's go to the woman in this video. Her reflexes so quick, we'll play it again and slow it down. Look, Watch as she jumps through her no car door window to fend In that slow motion. I didn't, have a, I didn't have a chance to think. All I was thinking was, he's not about to take my son. She has this just used her first name, which is Princess. She's the one that gave us this video. You can see the criminals got her pull new up ass. She Texaco almost scraped her new ass on the window. she was pumping gas Sunday night. Then watches the passenger in the blue sedan jumps out and tries to get into her okay. car. It was mind blowing. It was, I just couldn't believe he was doing as I'm standing here. But she was way too quick for the criminals who then drove off. She did scrape her face in the process. Princess Check me. Look, she threw the gas pump down. Watch this. Bam! Bam! Oh, two-step. Two-step drop. Two-step drop. Is she in there? Either they get your purse or get your car. She reached out to us because she was... She don't look real small. But they don't become victims either. Mm. Nobody wants anything taken from them. No matter if you have insurance or not. That's just a big inconvenience. Let me tell you. Princess is my new fucking hero, Okay. Yeah, shout out to Prince. Let's give, let's give her a too early for this shit clap. I want, I, want, I want to take her with me. I need to hire her to be on our security team. <laughs> Mom, okay? She was, she was, hey, Bri, she was flexible to jump through that window like that. Princess was like, mm -mm, y'all ain't doing that. Y'all ain't taking my shit. Get the fuck out of here. It's not going down. It's too early for that shit, okay? Out in these College Park streets. Hey, what's up, Bobby Brown? Joining Bobby Brown showing, joining us this morning on Friday. Don't be cruel. That's my because I would never be that cruel to you. Just like it, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Where y'all at this weekend, Bobby? Where y'all at this weekend? Where y'all at this weekend with the BBD tour? Shut the hell up. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, man, look, she, she wasn't going for it. She said, you're not about to take my shit. I work too hard for my shit. Get the fuck out and of that here. And that was a pretty car, too. That car was nice. It was a nice Benz, but that move was sweeter, <laughs> okay? Hey. The move was that move, okay? She said, no. Now, if that was a, now, if that was a 89 Camry, I wonder what she would have did. She probably would have did the same. <laughs> please, <laughs> please take this. <laughs> she would have turned her head. Take your car. Princess was She would have turned her head the other way. Yeah. Yeah, Princess was not having it. Oh, they stole my car. <laughs> Listen, we got to get ready to bounce, y'all. This has been an amazing week. We appreciate y'all rolling with us and joining us but again we are here each and every weekday morning talking about anything everything 
and absolutely nothing. It's absolutely nothing. Yeah, because we don't know that much. We don't know that much shit. We just be talking. We don't really know. Wait, do you remember what Timmy said he was going to be at this weekend? I know he, he's going to be in New York again. I forgot. So, y'all, this is what y'all do. Go to uh, at Comic Cop 2, the number two, okay, and follow little Timmy wherever the fuck he go. And he ain't hard to spot. Just stay close. That's right. Follow, follow me on, on social media, Facebook, Instagram, the mouth underscore moments with an S, the mouth underscore moments. Mm. Underscore moments with an S on yes. Facebook and IG. Yes. And I am on Snapchat, the mouth underscore moment without the S. The mouth underscore moment without the S. But if you're looking for me on Snapchat, don't look for me to have no um fairy tale um filters and all that shit. I ain't doing all that on there. But um Timmy gonna be in New York this weekend. I'm gonna be um I'm gonna be traveling this weekend all around Greenbelt, Maryland. Um you can find me. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, <laughs> yo, we love y'all, man. Remember, man, stay up, stay strong, and whatever you do this weekend, be amazing at it because you were born to be amazing. And we're gonna see y'all next week. And to all my fathers out there, man, happy Father's Day to the men that are not fathers that's doing things in young people's lives, coaches, and all those other people, preachers, man, that's working in the community with the young people, man. Happy Father's Day, man. Each one teach one because we got to, because we got to make ourselves better. And it starts with us, man. We love y'all. And it's way too early for this shit. Holla. So good morning and have a good weekend, folks. Happy Father's Day, dads. Dead be dead.